Drive underway right now to help some elderly residents get through a tough time after being displaced from their apartments. More than 80 residents at Gateway Place Apartments had to leave after a water main burst. WFO 48's Daquan Lee joins me live. Daquan, tell us more about the efforts to help those people who really need assistance until they can get back home. Liz, it's all thanks to one woman whose mom was actually among those who were displaced. As we reported Sunday, she made sure every tenant had hot meals. And today, we're learning that she opened a donation account to cover any extra needs they may run into. Now, it's been nearly two weeks since more than 80 residents were moved to hotels while that pipe gets repaired. Apartment management has been paying for those expenses, but Michelle Shaw knows the elderly need more help than that. She set up that donation account with Redstone Federal credit union with the hopes it would give others who want to help an outlet to do so. Shaw doesn't want any of the glory that comes with this. However, she does want to ease the anxiety residents may get from not knowing what's next for them. We're going to need more meals, um, more help. Um, you know, the more help we get, the better these people will be, even if it is a simple I can take you to the doctor. That sometimes goes a long way. Now, Shaw also told me residents would get an update next Friday on when they could possibly be back in their homes. Reporting live in Huntsville, Daquan Lee, 48, on your side.